Hey, what's up, YouTube? In this video, I'll be showing you how to make a set of mob related floaties. We have a zombie, a creeper, an ender dragon, a Steve, a skeleton, and also a wither skeleton. My recommendation is that you should probably make these in a pool, but feel free to make them on dry land if you like. Let's get started. The first floaty we will make is a zombie floaty. These are made at the top level of the water, which is why I'm placing these onto glass. You might have to do something similar. And we begin by placing a green glass pane, left of it a blue glass pane, behind it light blue, and then in front of it, lime green. We then simply want to place a zombie head on the corner, facing outwards <laughs> diagonally, and there we have our zombie floaty. Next is a creeper floaty, which we will begin by placing a lime glass pane, left of it a white glass pane, behind it a lime glass pane, and connecting back a green glass pane. And then we simply place our creeper head diagonally as we did the zombie. Next is the ender dragon, which we will begin with a black glass pane, extend left, back, across to create a square or diamond shape. We then want to take the back two corners of the square and place an additional black glass extending off of each, which we will then connect together in the corner to form pretty much a figure eight. We can then place a light grey glass pane on top of the back corner of the body and then extend a light grey glass off of the edge. We also want to create wings as that is the tail section and this is the body. So the wings extend off of the front of our figure eight and we want to place a light gray glass extending forwards and then one backwards. And you can make these bigger if you like, but we want to make the exact same thing on the opposite side. And this gives the appearance of wings. And of course, all we have to do now is add the head <laughs> diagonally on the front of the floaty. Next is a Steve floaty, which will be a light blue glass, left of it a blue glass, behind it light blue, and then across a blue. And then all we have to do, of course, is add the head on the corner, and there we have Steve. Next is the skeleton, which is a white glass pane with a light grey to the left, white behind, and then light grey to join back together. And last but not least, the skeleton skull on the corner, which gives us our floaty. And last but not least, we have the wither skeleton, which we begin by placing a black glass, left of it a grey, behind it black, connect together with grey, and of course, finally, the skull on the corner, which is our last floaty, and concludes this tutorial. I hope that you have enjoyed it. Please remember to like and subscribe, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.